this is Jeannie, and I'm here to show you a um, haul I received from Tina here on YouTube. She uh, is very generous, and uh, she puts up these lots for sale, and I appreciate it. And I was uh, happened to be able to uh, get a couple of these lots. Anyway, um, I'm going to share with you the stamps that I received. So this first one is at Outlines. I love these kind of stamps because you can stamp it on one, two, three, four, five, maybe five different papers and pop them up. So that would be a cool look. And then here's a, this would be pretty on Christmas paper, don't you think? I have this uh, Rosa stamp. This is a PSX stamp. I believe I have this one. And if I do, I'll put it in my D stash. This is a cute little Christmas boot. This is from Tucson, Arizona. Isn't that cute? I love that, that the star, the, the spur on the top is the star. Cute, huh? And then this little one, this is a primitive stamp. I'm trying to make this go fast. Some more flowers. <clears throat> And little birdies on the bench. I love this one. This would be cute to watercolor, I think. And bears. My dear mother loved bears. I wish, you know, she were still alive and I'd be stamping her a bunch of new kind of bears. All different kind of bears, too. To make up, you know, it would be cute making a bear journal. I just thought about that. Hey, Tina, you think that'd be a good idea? Make a bear journal. Have you done that? Because I know you like bears too, and I know you have a lot. Had a lot of bear stamps. This one with the little hug and the bow. Love that one. Of course, Boyd's bear. I think I have maybe one Boyd's bear stamp. So this is a nice one to go to my collection. She's holding it. looks like a blueberry pie. Let's see if it has a name on it. Just says Bailey the Baker with a blueberry pie. There's a little angel bear. This is Santa Rosa. Make sure I'm getting that in the picture right. I remember her sharing this little bunny. And I don't have any bunny stamps. So this is Darling. I love that. And some little prim hearts. And again, another bunny, which I don't have a bunny stamp. So there you go. With the little angel wings. It would be cute to color. Well, Tina, thank you so much. I got bunny stamps now. <laughs> It's a cute one. I love that. It looks like quilted fabric type fabric. Oops. That on here. And then this pretty stamp. Where's this one from? This one is a Stampa Rosa with the little tags. I think I no, I've got it the right way. I'm sitting there thinking I had it the wrong way, but it that's a big stamp too. We have this little bull, sick bear. Look at that. A little sick bear. Here he is. A little thermometer in his mouth. Another cute little bear. Oh my goodness, what is the oh it's a dots and what is this though? It says uh Lacey. Name is Lacey. Hmm. Cute, cute, cute. Well, see, I wasn't even expecting. I was getting a lot of bunny stamps, but I got in the I have a collection now. <laughs> Let's see. Here's another cute little bear with the little patches on it. Now, my uh, daughter-in-law is a sunflower lover, so this is a, a really pretty sprig of sunflowers, and I'm sure that's what that is. Let's see where it comes from. 
uh, Great Impressions, Washington. So that's pretty. And Easter eggs, some Easter eggs to go with those bunnies. And I believe this is a stamp. Oh, it is 2000. What was this from? Doesn't say, but uh, cute little scarecrow lady with the birdhouses. And I love uh, this one. What is this one? This one is uh, Stampendous, 1998 with the kitty cat and if you know well if you've looked at my channel you see there's a kitty cat on my page that that was my tabby cat that we have when we, when we moved into this house so I, lo I particularly love that stamp oh another Boyd stamp looky there this one is called sweetie pies let's see if I can get that in right isn't that cute? Sweetie Pies. Another bear. It's got like, I guess you could make those movable arms maybe. <laughs> there we go. Got a lot of bears. I think this thing's going to topple over. <gasps> Whoop, like I said, I might be toppling all of them over. Little Baby Animals. This is All Night Media. Wildlife Babies. Look at that. Cute, cute. Hopefully that's... There we go. Sometimes it doesn't like to reflect. Um, clear the picture very well. Here's another one. Uh, this one is... Oh, I have no idea. There's no name on it. But it is a cool patriotic lady. I like that. July 4th coming up. That'd be a cute stamp to use. Here's another one. This one is a dragonfly collage from Uptown Rubber Stamps. I've not heard of them. But that's cool. You could color those all up and cut them apart if you wanted to. And another bunny. <laughs> this will come in handy. Uh, Come next uh, Easter time, won't they? And this one says, Spring, a time to plant seeds of kindness. The little girl. Fruit of the Spirit of, is love. Now, I believe I have this stamp. Uh, another stamp that I can put in my de stash. So... I like to move things along to somebody else that might be able to use these. And I have been saying I'm going to do D-Stash, and I am. We've been very busy visiting my uh, in-laws. And uh, they're seven-hour drive away from here. And we've been trying to go at least once a month. And uh, that's been keeping us busy as well as our, um, our grands, grandchildren that live close by. Up a little bit, a pair of bears, a pair of bears. These are hmm. so CC rubber stamps. There's no name, but uh, I don't know. Some of you may have to correct me, but that looks like grains of something, maybe wheat. I have no idea. Some you'd have to tell me what you think that is. Oh my goodness, look at this bunny. <laughs> Look at that one. Oh, if I can get him right. I am so sorry. I'm still trying to get used to how I directed this camera. It's a little off. Some more flowers. Flowers. And stars. darling it's a cute little um this is a psx this is a um, carousel horse so 
Sorry, I start talking before I show you the stamp. There you go. Is it going to come into focus? Here we go. I would just say fast forward through the pictures if you need to because, yeah, that is a foot of an animal, which I don't know what it is, but my guess would be, could that be a bear? See the claws? I have no idea. Let's see if it has a name on it. No, it just says 1994 PSX. Uh, 95 Stampin' Up! Bunny Rabbit. Hmm. There we go. And here's another footprint. This says the Loyal Order of Friends of Boyd's. Ah! So I guess with those Boyd stamps, that little footprint goes with that. Oh, this would be pretty watercolored up. Gift from, hmm. It's a hero art stamp. Pretty flowers in the watering can. I'm almost to the bottom of the box. Let's see, here's a, a fence with a birdie. Be pretty colored up as well. This is a saying. It says, there is a calmness to a life lived in gratitude, a quiet joy. Ralph H. Blum. It's a Stampin' Up! stamp. That's a pretty quote. Hmm. Not that you have to see it. I just read it. Here is... Another little watering can with the little hearts. Little flying bears. Some tulips. They look like tulips anyways. This this is Ma Magenta Stamp Company. I remember them from years ago. And uh, another bear. And this is Stamps Happen. Little angel bear huh, with wings. And one last thing, I'm not sure. Okay, this one's called a Repeat Impressions from 2005. Oh, okay, so it looks like a bear. Bear. A bear. A bear. A bear. And then whatever the saying is. And I'm not sure, I'd have to stamp it out to tell you. And that is it on that box. So thanks for looking. I'm back with another share in a bit. Thank you.